Hello, my name is Alex. Welcome, welcome back. If you are new here, please consider subscribing, liking, sharing, if you enjoyed this video, of course. And yeah, subscribe for yoga. And let's begin in a child's pose. You don't need any props unless you want one. Big toes together, knees apart. On an exhale, walk your hands out and away from you. Bring the forehead down. Scan your body for tension. Notice if you feel present yet and give yourself some time to actively bring yourself to the present moment. This inhale, this exhale. Arrive. Walk your hands in, just enough to thread the right arm underneath the left for a thread the needle variation. Right palm is up, rest the forehead on the left hand. Use the breath to work into the shoulder. Switch so that the right ear is down. Left hand on top of the right hand Press the left elbow straight, almost straight, and twist the middle upper back. Release. Use your left hand to help you up and switch sides, right arm forward, left arm underneath. You don't have to straighten the left elbow just feel the left shoulder softening. And switch so that the ear is down. Right hand on top, middle upper back twist. Release. Press into the right hand to come back up to a tabletop. Tuck the toes and let's draw some circles with the torso forward, back and around, almost all the way to an up dog, almost all the way back to a child's pose. Just organic movement. If your wrists get tired, this is a nice chance to stretch them out. And Neutral spine, somewhere in the middle. Three intentional cat cows. Inhale, arch. Let these build. Round, exhale. Inhale, open up. And long, exhale, press. Once more. And ground. Neutral. Tuck the toes, hover the knees, shift the weight 
forward a couple of inches. Notice what fires up. Breathe. I think everything's firing up. <laughs> Inhale. Exhale here. You've got this. Inhale. Downward facing dog. Press back. Open up through the shoulders, the chest. Walk it out. I like to stretch the tops of my feet while I'm here, here when I remember it. I was gonna say something else. Let's find stillness in down dog. Walk to the top of the mat. Let's relax over both legs. Knees are soft. Press to stand one vertebrae at a time. Lift up. Roll the shoulders back and down. Bring your palms together. Connect to the present moment. Perhaps set an intention for your practice. On an inhale, arms reach wide and overhead. Look up, reach up. Exhale, fold. Hands down, right foot steps back, lunge. Left foot back, plank. Lower all the way down. Quad stretch, rest the forehead on the left hand, right foot in, press the hips down. And switch. and release. One cobra, flex the toes against the mat, feel the thighs engage. Use your middle upper back strength to lift up. And lower. Tabletop, downward facing dog, just for an exhale, trying to get a little bit of movement in. Right foot steps between the hands. Build some heat is what I meant to say. You're in a lunge. Adding on a lunge twist. Left hand down, right arm opens. Right hand down. Forward fold at the top of your mat. Lengthen over the legs. Press to stand. Inhale, arms overhead. Interlace the fingers. Index fingers out. Press the palms together. Press a button on the ceiling for three breaths. Lift out. Fold, for fold forward. Hands down, left foot back, lunge. Right foot back, plank. Lower all the way down again. We're gonna open up through the chest. Cactus the left arm. We extended the arm out all the way last time we did something like this. Cactus, so that's also your reminder, do yoga with me all the time because then everything feels good over time because yeah, roll onto the left hip. Open up through the left shoulder, chest. Breathe. This is pretty intense, so don't worry about how far you're going. Good. 
and switch sides. And come back to center. Press up to a tabletop. Downward dock. Left foot steps between the hands. Lunge, twist. Right hand down. Left arm opens. Left hand down. Forward fold, feet together at the top of your mat, lengthen out, find more space. Round up, bring the palms to touch, reconnect to the present moment, to your intention. Inhale, arms reach wide and overhead, reach straight up or start back bending, three breaths. Lift out, fold forward. Hands down, step the right foot back to a lunge. Left foot back plank. Lower to your knees if you need to or want to. Chaturanga. This is just as far as you need to go. Hold here for one more breath. And inhale, upward facing dog. Let's linger here, feel the triceps release. Press the shoulders down. Feel the entire front body opening up. Someday, the knees will lift, pull the chest through. Downward dog. Right foot steps between the hands, lunge. Hands to your hips, take your time, set up your foundation, crescent lunge. Upper body lifts, stay low in the front knee. Someday the back leg straightens, arms overhead, try not to arch the chest through. So articulate. Hands back down to the mat. Big step to the top of the mat. Scan the body right to left. Inhale, halfway lift. And fold. Utkatasana, bend the knees, sit back. Reach the fingertips away from the tailbone. And press to stand, bring the palms to touch. Inhale. Three breaths, arms up. Lift out, fold forward. Hands down, left foot back, lunge. Right foot back plank. Chaturanga push up this time, knees up or down. Chaturanga, inhale, upward facing dog. Exhale, downward dog. Left foot between the hands, lunge. As the hips start to open, Engage the core to keep everything in control. Crescent lunge is next. Hands to hips for balance, arms reach overhead. Find a little bit, bit more length in the side bodies. Swan dive the hands forward, we're back in a lunge. 
Step up to the top of the mat, feet together. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, fold. Utkatasana, chair pose, awkward pose. And stand up. Bring the palms to touch. Inhale, arms overhead. Hold the left wrist with the right hand. And you're going to lift up and over. Press down through the left heel. Nice my side body, good morning reach. And reset in the center. Try not to be arching the back. We want the side to be feeling this. Reach up and over to the left. Press down through the right heel. And come back to center. Back bend or arms straight up. Stand tall, fold forward. Inhale, halfway lift, long flat back. From here, hands down, plank pose. I need to lower to my knees for this. What we're gonna do is elbow down, elbow down, and then come back up to a plank and like I like to switch sides so just go at your own pace a few times I'd rather do a bunch of these for a while and build some strength I'd rather that for you than to be all wobbly and not get as much out of it if you were in a plank pose notice how this creates some heat All right, now plank pose. <laughs> Hold here for a few rounds of breath. Vinyasa back to downward facing dog. That's one or two chaturangas. Inhale, upward dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Ooh, now I'm sweating. Bring the right knee behind the right wrist for pigeon. Modify as needed. We're here for a few rounds of breath. And as you know, this is your chance to choose to stay present and not play on your phone. But if you do decide to play on your phone, make sure you add me on Instagram. Make sure you like this video. And then come back to the present. Smooth out any tension you might have noticed. Creep in a few more rounds of breath right where you are. Couple more breaths right where you are. Option two, add a quad stretch. Bring the foot to you, not the other way around. Feel the left shoulder opening up. 
like we did in that cactus arm stretch. I have not done this one in a while. I've been so busy studying crypto and trying to find Picasso paintings at Goodwill. Let's go back to a three-legged dog. Start from downward facing dog. Reach the right leg back and up. Like ha only half JK. <laughs> if you're listening and that made you laugh, let me know. And we're back to a downward facing dog. Lift on to the toes, tuck the chin, ripple through, upward facing dog. Back to downward dog. Pigeon, left side. And I'll let you enjoy your pigeon in peace this time, if I can. A few more rounds of breath right where you are. Or add on your quad stretch if you did on the other side. Remember to open through the shoulder and the chest. And we're going back to a downward dog, three-legged dog. Lift the left leg back and up. And two feet on the mat. Ripple through to an upward-facing dog. Lower the knees. Child's pose just for a long exhale. Walk your hands in. From here, let's just simply rotate to the right with the upper body. Don't worry about not having the leverage you might be used to. So just lengthen up and rotate. Breathe. and switch. Come back to center. Let's stand on our knees for camel pose. Begin with the hands on the lower back, lifting the chest. Bring the heels closer to you if you need to. Otherwise, reach back with one hand at a time Open up, press down and lift up, breathe. Mm. 
Lift out. Sit on your knees or on your heels. Twist to the right. And to the left. Come back to center. Stand up on the knees. Second set. Notice the desire to adjust and just decide to manage your energy. Trust in your body-mind connection. Lift up and go back. Release, sit tall on the heels, and then this time we're going to one last downward facing dog. Lengthen the spine, lengthen through the back of the legs. Tabletop, child's pose. Remember being here just a little while ago. Embrace, appreciate what you've accomplished since you were here last, not only physically, but where you are mentally now. This space is always here for you. And I don't necessarily mean the yoga mat, I mean mentally, but you know, I am always here too. Let's make our way to a comfortable seated position. Sit up tall. Roll the shoulders back and down. And sit up taller. Left arm up and over. Side body reach. And switch. Arms overhead, a little bit more. Reach the arms overhead. Exhale, lower the hands down through center. Once more for our closing breath. Inhale, reach up, lengthen. Long exhale, hands lower down. I am so grateful for your presence. Thank you. Thank you. Namaste. Happy. Well, this will go live tomorrow because uploading takes a lifetime. It's a Thursday in September. Instagram me, uh, click on a link below. If you really want to help, you can let my shorts playlist play and that'll just, you know, help me look at some of my analytics and be really happy. Namaste. <laughs>